When Tony Abbott talks about this sort of country, about prime agricultural land, our policy is that you don't you don't uh, extract coal seam gas, and you certainly don't mine this sort of country unless the farmer says you can. And that's been the premise, a basic premise to our policy now for over three years. We also have a policy that, in terms of uh, of any extraction of uh, of coal seam gas that it doesn't have a permanent effect on the water table and it also doesn't affect the productivity of the land. Now, in the end, we're in a pretty difficult position because whilst we can have those policies and we will have those policies and they will remain our policies when we go to the election and afterwards, we do need more. I wasn't expecting applause today. I do, we do need more in terms of scientific knowledge. Now, my grandfather was a geologist, so I've got just enough geology knowledge to be dangerous. I do still have his geo pick sitting on my desk beside the picture of the peanut thrasher. Uh, I do occasionally raise it when people annoy me, but it's there to also remind me that if you understand the science of geology, you understand most things in life. And the reality is that we do need to understand more about particularly what's going on here. Uh, I have misgivings. Um, I, I want to see a better explanation of the interaction particularly between the condamine alluvium and the Walloons. We need to understand whether or not this country can be touched at all and if it can't be touched without damaging the aquifers then it shouldn't be and, and everyone needs to understand that. We do need to know what is going on underneath the ground that we're all standing on. We know pretty well what happens in the first four or five feet of it and we certainly know how well and productive it can be but we need to know what's going on all the way down there and, and the coalition will support that we'll continue to support that if we're fortunate enough to win government in september i was the one who who drove the issue in new south wales where the uh, resource companies were told that they couldn't drill within two kilometers of houses now i do those things not because i want publicity because it, but because it's the right thing to do and in the end, that's what I do. I try and represent the people I represent as best I can, and I try and do the right thing. So if you need a voice at a federal level on this issue, then I'm always there.